the tortoise and the hare. Once upon a time in Kalamazoo, where the animals roam freely like Pico Merdu, there lived a lively bunny who chanced upon a scale, <gasps> weighed herself, exclaimed, oh my, and thus begins this tale. Her neighbor chanced to hear her shriek and called out, What's up, dear? Oh, it seems I've nibbled a bit too much and my belly's as big as my rear. Oh, I can relate, her neighbor replied. Slowly, I've put it on, too. It seems over time the weight just creeps up. But I know what I'm going to do. <gasps> do tell, said the bunny. Won't you come in for tea? I've been baking all morning. Incredible delicacy. Oh, no, said the tortoise as she crept into sight. I can't, for I started to diet last night. Oh, you're so good, but I bet I can lose faster. Let's make a challenge to see who really is the diet master. The hare always loved a race and knew it'd make weight loss fun. Besides, she was sure to win and lose with her intense motivation. So she ordered equipment and exercised away, doing aerobics six times a day. She always loved veggies, so ate only these. Carrots, celery, lettuce, and peas. Mrs. Tortoise, however, just took it in stride, eating four food groups, pushing dessert aside. She also did aerobics just three times a week and took the stairs and walked to work, and never did she peep to see how much her weight dwindled for all her efforts done. Unlike Mrs. Hare, who weighed herself at the setting of every sun, with her clothes, her shoes, her teeth, and wig all carefully removed, and all air expelled from the depths of her lungs, happy only when she did lose. Mrs. Tortoise, however, could tell deep inside by the way her shell moved from side to side, and by the way that Mr. Turtle asked if she put a tighter girdle. One day, Mrs. Hare sat in her kitchen crying, for she had just been caught snitching by Mrs. Tortoise, who'd come over to chat and borrow the bunny's baseball bat. She now played shortstop for their winning team, the realization of a lifelong dream. Now, friend, what's up with you? You'll gain back all you've lost. Before you eat more cookies, be sure you've counted the cost. Oh, it's just that I am so depressed. I'm shooting pains at every bone. Mrs. Hare dropped her head to the table. I'm tired. Please leave me alone. All right, if that's your heart's desire. But Saturday the weigh-in takes place. Remember, you were the one who wanted to embark on this silly race. But I'm glad. I feel great and I'm still losing. I'm so thankful for what you've done. Oh, go hit a home run with the children. I don't care anymore if you've won. When Saturday came, the town gathered round, shocked to discover Miss Hare gained ten pounds, which all considered a great disaster, as they crowned Mrs. Tortoise Kalamazoo's diet master. <laughs>